Hey guys, Henry here from Product Creation Formula. In this video, we're going to be talking about the best alternative to Vidnami that I can find. Okay, but before we go ahead and do it, I just want to let you know, here at Product Creation Formula, we love to give you tips and tricks to help you create your products quickly and easily. Along with that, we also do product reviews, as well as tips on how to make money online. So if that's the sort of thing that interests you, how about you smash that like button, as well as subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. Okay guys, let's go check it out. Okay, now the site we're looking at today is called Yive. Now originally when they built Yive, it wasn't designed to be an alternative to Vietnami. What it was designed to do on the other hand was to become a bulk video creator. And with that in mind, they saw that Vietnami was closing down, so they decided to create the Yai Video Builder, which is what we're looking at here. And the best part about this, it's a one-time payment. You don't need to do any more than $77. One time. And you know, like Vietnami, for example, it was a constant ongoing monthly amount. But this one is just a single payment of $77. So let's go check it out and you can make up your own mind. All right, now let's go down and have a quick look here. Now they do a little bit of a video overview here. Now be aware that this was not originally designed as a alternative to Vietnami. What you have does do, you can create videos on autopilot. It does have a voiceover. Well, I will say that. That's really good that they do have the voiceover. They do have the, um, they use both Google Polly as, sorry, Amazon Polly as well as Google Voice. So they've got those two options as well for you. And you can edit it in the thing and it's fairly easy to use. So, but it does require, it does have a slight learning curve at first because you go, trying to get your head around how to work this can be a little bit confusing. But we'll go through all that in this video, and it's not that hard. Once you, once you learn how to do it, it's pretty easy. So you go through, have a little look at what they do. Okay, so what you can do is you can create videos on autopilot for you. Create videos 24-7, 365 days a year. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. Create videos from RSS feeds. Create videos from any keywords. Create videos from any URL. Create videos from Amazon reviews. I wouldn't do that either. Create videos for multiple languages. Create videos for your own scripts. That one I would suggest you do. Create videos from your own scripts or from your own content. Create videos from one script for you. Create unique videos from one of your own videos. What can you do with the eye? Well, obviously there's a whole bunch of things you can do. And you can have a look at what it does do and so forth. But the thing I want to just show you is we'll go straight down to the bottom because I know that you guys are just interested in the prices. Now, if you want to go for the starter pack, which is what I would do, you're allowed up to 3,000 videos a month. And that's spamming YouTube. So don't do 3,000 videos a month. That's way too many. And you, you'll get kicked off the platform if you do that. So don't do that. So my suggestion is just, if you want to create a video every day, you can do that. Just make sure it's a unique video that you created. And that's only $77 US. Now, let's go and have a look at Yive. Now we're here on the dashboard of Yive. Now let's go and have a look at the various campaigns that we have here. I'm going to go here to my list count list of campaigns and I've got them as sleep disorders how to expect the best and how number two, part two and how to expect the best part one let's go have a look at this one how to expect the best part two so as I scroll down you'll notice that I actually have this one here and all we have to do is click on that one and we, it will open up in a new area and down the bottom you'll notice I have two videos here now the first one I rendered because I didn't have, I didn't have about, I forgot to put a call, call to action in this one. 
and this one actually has a call to action in it. Now let's have a quick look at it. Right, that first part was a little bit boring, but it does get better. All right, now as you can see, it does videos and it's, it's relevant to what you're actually talking about. Now let's say for example, I decided I wanted to edit this video. All I have to do is go to the very top, go to where it says actions, and I can just hit edit. And this gives me the ability to edit the script itself or in the timeline. You can see if I go here, I can click on the screen here if I, if I want to do a different video. And scroll down, we can choose a different thing. So let's go, we can go across to the next one. And all you need to do is very similar to what you used to do in Vietnam. You just choose the image or choose the, the one you wanted. And it will give you some various images and videos that you can look up for yourself. And as you go through, you can choose the ones you want and go through and change it up. Now, there it goes. It's come up with different images now. And you can do that. The thing is, this is really good. I mean, it's really easy to edit. It's really simple. And you'll find it's not bad. So let's go back up here. You got your script, which is where you add your script. And then, you, as you can see, you add a couple of lines between each line, and it will then put that to into each area. So let's have a look at how we do this. Yes, I'm going to leave there. How do we do this? So first of all, we go to campaigns. Click on the campaigns and let's go new campaign. So we click on that. So what we want to do is enter the title. So I'm going to do this one. I'm going to put an alternative approach to sleep disorder. So let's copy that and put that straight in there. And we want to use, in this particular case, we want to use the spin tax video. It's definitely the easiest way to go. You click on that and I have already got um, some text here I'm going to just grab that and what you need to do is go down, to the, go down to the next step and we want to enter our keyword which will be sleep disorder then as we go down you can have a look at the pre-roll bucket don't worry about that so much you can go down here to add assets if you will, or asset keywords, which will be sleep disorder. Or you can also add other ones as well. Sleeping. Restful sleep. You get the idea. And then we can go down. You can also search for assets using each slide, or text, buckets, or whatever. Now this is where you enter the script. This is where you really do need to make sure you do a great job. So what you're going to need to do is go back up to the top. And it suggests that where there's a break, you hit, hit it down twice. And this way it takes it down and allows you to be able to make that into a new slide. And every time you knock it down a couple of spaces, that becomes a new slide. So I would find every full stop you've got there or every natural break, you then turn that into a new slide. So I'm gonna pause the video while I do that. Now, one thing I will say, I forgot to mention, is if it has several, if it has any special characters, you really should remove those special characters because often they will actually say what those special characters are instead of ignoring them and doing what it says. So my suggestion would be if you have quotation marks or anything like that, remove the quotation marks or it will say quotation mark. So avoid, to avoid that, you just need to make sure that you do remove anything like quotation marks. Otherwise, it will come through on your video. Now, I'd also strongly suggest that you put a call to action at the very end and then that way it will sound and sing a lot more natural. Now, of course, you're going to have to add things like your title, how to tell if you have a sleep disorder. I'm just going to copy that one here. 
enter that there. And you don't have to put URLs, but you do need to put a description. So I'm going to go sleep disorder. And anywhere there's an asterisk, you just have to add your big details there. And once again, sleep disorder. And intro text. Yeah, you don't have to worry about that. Now the colors, I'm choosing to change the colors a little bit. So to do that, I'm going to go and choose maybe an orange color. And over here, oops, it easy, didn't mean to do that. Choose, click on that and choose a darker orange color. That will do. And I'm just going to leave it at that. I'm going to go over to outro text and the rest is fine. Well, you could change that as well, but I'm choosing to leave it as is. And then we can go here and you can just hit save and go to next step. Now, I might even increase the amount of slides we have to say more. And this way, we have a better chance of having a longer video. Now, I'm going to go between probably five seconds and 10 seconds long. Duration per slide that is. Now that makes it a two and a half minute or 2.5 minute slide or two to five minute slide and that's what we want. And we can go through add animation text. Yes, we do want to do that. And we just want to hit. Now what we're going to do here is we're going to choose a voice. This one here is Amazon Polly. Then we also have Google Voice. So we can choose from either one of these. So have a look at Amazon Polly. Yep. And then we can also have a look at Google Voice and have a look at what they've got there. So we can have a look at Mark. I like Mark. I think I'll keep him. So I'm going to go save and go to next step. Distribution none. Don't worry about the rest because you have to upgrade to do those. Now, I highly suggest only make it one video. How many videos do you want? Just do one video. Don't do more than one a day because it will be too much and you're likely to get banned. So don't do that. This was designed as a bulk video creator. And my strong suggestion is don't upload it straight onto YouTube. Download it if you need to do any extra editing or anything else to it to be compliant with YouTube. Then do it that way and upload it manually. Way less issues. You need to stick with with YouTube's rules. And okay, so make sure you click start immediately, which is what I'm doing. And then I'm going to hit save campaign. Now what I'll do is once this is rendering, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video. And as you can see, we go to the bottom here. It's now thinking about what it's doing. Now my suggestion would be go over here to actions. I'm going to go run now. And it's now thinking about what it's doing and it's currently rendering. So campaign will run shortly. And in about three to five minutes time, we'll come back and we'll continue the video. Okay, we're back. Now, as you can see, it's now created. Now all I have to do is just, I can either go over here and, and look at view, or I can click on the actual words themselves. Now what we need to do is just scroll down to the very bottom and have a look at it right here. Over here at the top, we can click over here and then we can now click edit. And we can go over here from the beginning slide here and we can move on from them. Now, as you can see, you've got all these different slides here and some of these slides don't really work for this image. So this one's okay. So let's go down and have a look at this at editing. So we can now hit edit and we can scroll down and we can have a look at the various ones. Okay, so this one here, you might wanna change that and you can go sleepy and see what ones they actually come up with. So we go to here. 
There you go. Click on this one here. That looks all right. Yep, there are many people that have an undiagnosed sleep disorder. They may feel very sleepy during the day. That works out really well. So, like Vietnami, it's a little bit of editing to do occasionally. But yeah, you can have a look through and see what they have. Okay, now once you finish, all you really need to do is hit Save Changes. And if you want to be able to do this, I would suggest you Save and Render. Now what that will do is it will recreate the video for you and re-render it. And as you can see, video is rendering, it may take a while. So once it's finished rendering, it will then have a second video ready for you to watch. Enjoy the current one you have, then you can download it to your desktop. And then you can then go in to wherever you do your thumbnails, create your thumbnails and upload them onto YouTube. So it's really easy. It's very similar in a lot of ways to Vietnami. But in other ways, not so much. So be aware of the differences and don't get so stuck on the fact that these guys make bulk videos because all you're wanting to do as a YouTube video creator is perhaps make one video a day because you don't want to bulk upload and spam your videos to YouTube or you will be banned. Just be aware of that. We don't want you getting banned. Don't break YouTube rules. Stick within the rules and you'll be okay. Okay guys, I hope you liked this video. And if you did, please consider smashing the like button as well as subscribing and hitting the bell icon so you can be notified whenever we upload more videos. Hey, and while you're at it, why not share and also leave a comment down below of any other Vietnam alternative that you may know of that I haven't reviewed yet. Okay guys, thanks for watching and bye for now.